Hi guys, as you can see, the touchpad is not responding. I'm trying to click. It's not clicking on the Windows icon for an HP EliteBook 840 G5. Also, this method works for a G6 Series 2. Stay tuned and I will show you how to replace this. By the way, this keyboard is not original. Right, as you can see, in my hand, this is the replacement touchpad with the buttons. So guys, this is what you need to do. Remove these screws. We'll undo them. This is the screwdriver you need. So once you've done that, this cover will come off. Now what you need to do is remove this battery. So with this screwdriver, I'm going to show you which screws you need to remove. So remove all these screws. Now, this battery cable as well needs to be removed. Now, lift it up. And remove this, yeah? Just like this. Now, this is where you need to access the touchpad. I'm going to show you. Remove this. So you've got to remove all these screws. You don't need that. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine screws in total, guys. And then remove this ribbon. And this one too. So once I removed all the screws and unclipped the ribbon, it will come off, guys. The touch pad will lift up along with the two buttons i forgot to mention unclip this ribbon too so it detached from the touchpad so once removed vice versa put your replacement one in and you're all set to go don't forget this one guys Got the two buttons. Right, I've just fitted the replacement one in. As you can see, this one's got the NFC feature. So this is the old one. You see, this one doesn't have it. Doesn't have the NFC. Anyway, guys, look, just remember where the cables go. And don't forget this goes in there. Right, it's time to test the touchpad. Is it going to respond? Moment of truth. Yes. It's working correctly, guys, as you can see. Let me click on that yep all good right if this video has helped you 
please like and subscribe and I will catch you on the next one.